A dream lift off for these girls at Sri Harikota. As SSLB D2, India's next generation rocket, put all three satellites in the orbit. One of them, Azadi Sat 2, a communication satellite, was built completely by schoolgirls across India from Kanyakumari to Kashmir. At the viewers gallery at Sri Harikota, there was excitement as a large contingent of girls who were part of this Azadi 2 sat mission cheered as the SSLB rocket took off. Satyabani, a class 11 daughter of a bus driver from rural Tamil Nadu, now wants to pursue space science. Nishit Anju, daughter of a mechanic in Karnataka too, has set her eyes on space tech. I like to become a space scientist. This uh, project will help me more uh, in, uh, for uh, space research. Uh, I should also make a satellite and I should also launch it and it should be a successful. These girls traveled from across the country to witness the historic launch. Initially, Kavisha's father wouldn't let her come for this. Sir, what to say? Their mindset can be seen. And my ma'am ma ma also convinced her a lot. Then they say, okay, you can go. The experience has come as a boost to their confidence. And if you are given a stage, if you are given a platform, you'll shine definitely. And see, 750 girls are building a satellite. It would be a grand success. Right. I'm sure about this. SSLV Hip Hop Hooray! Space Kids, the group behind this mission, trained 750 girls online even after the SSLV maiden mission failed last year. Space is the future and we need a lot of girls because girls are very good in multitasking, I would definitely say. And that's the reason we need more girls. What do boys do now? <laughs> Wait and watch! With low-cost access to space becoming a reality with SSLV D2, India's space program is certainly scaling greater heights. At Sri Harikota with Suresh, Sam Daniel, Fine TV.